Today is Sunday, July 12th, and I'm gonna take you around the garden really fast. It is really hot out here. Um, you'll see the sun is shining, which is good because we've had a ton of rain. My garden isn't doing all that great because we have had little sunshine. Um, we've had so much rain here, but not a lot of sun until this weekend. So hopefully it'll last. So here is my lemon balm. It's doing okay. And my mint and my strawberries are still there. I have tons of pots that I need to get rid of, like all of these. Um, that's some lavender in there. I'll take that out and put it in the ground. Um, all this lettuce, it needs to go. I just haven't had a chance to get out because we've had so much rain. The spearmint doesn't look to be doing all that great. This came back from last year. My pepper plant, it's, it's doing okay. It has pepper on it, but it looks really um, pale, I guess I would say. So we'll walk down to the main garden. Okay, so here's the garden. Not looking all that great. I don't know if I told you guys the temperature. It is, I believe, 90, 96, but the heat index is 103. So it is really, really hot here. So I have some kale that I still need to pull up my chamomile here. I have um, cut this back, but it is going crazy again. It is so pretty and it smells so good. Doesn't taste all that great, but it smells so good. And it's so pretty with the little flowers. So here is a, here is a tomato plant. And as you can see, there's nothing on here, I don't think. Um, let's see, what is this? This is a beefsteak tomato. So it's still relatively small. And here's another tomato. It does have little tomatoes on it. Um, let's see what this is. I'm so sorry. It's been so long since I've been out here. I don't see the sticker right now, but it's some kind of little cherry tomato. Plant. It's been so long since I've been out here because it's been so wet. I did get out and weed it the other day. The weeds were going crazy. But there's some cucumbers that are still pretty small. Here's another red pepper plant. I don't see any peppers on it. There is another pepper plant behind it or in front of it. That is probably a red or a orange pepper plant. cucumber this one is just starting to work its way up the trellis slowly slowly and here is a jalapeno pepper plant and just some little bitty jalapenos usually I would have tons by now but I see a couple coming on and here's another tomato plant this is a big boy I don't see anything on it. My parsley is doing just fine. I'm sure it <laughs> it didn't have a problem with all the shade that we had. And here's another pep uh, tomato plant. I'm sorry. Um, I don't see anything on it. And this is a mortgage lifter. I don't think I've ever grown one of these. So we'll see. Here's another uh, cucumber plant that's looking like it wants to work its way up the trellis. Um, it's a yellow brandy wine. There's a small tomato on it. Just one. My chives are doing well as always. And this is a um, uh, sweet banana pepper plant. I did get one really big pepper off of it maybe two or three weeks ago before all the rain set in. 
I see some flowers on there. Oh, and I see one little pepper there coming. And then here's another pepper plant. Um, I don't know if you could see it back there. It's a orange bell pepper. And here's another little cherry tomato plant. I'm not sure what it is, but I see a few tomatoes on there. Um, it's not doing much at all over here. Hopefully, we're supposed to be hot and dry, I think, the majority of the week. So hopefully it will kickstart my garden. So I'll walk over to show you the herbs. So I just cut everything back over here. Um, whenever we would get a break in the rain, I would run out and try to weed or cut something back before the rain would start up again. So I did get over here and cut all of this back. My tarragon, it grows so fast. All of it does. But there's my tarragon there. There's a little bit more back there. I need to empty this bird feeder. It's got water sitting in it. Um, Here's my oregano. I've chopped it back. Get out some. There's some thyme. And then over here, I believe, is my lemon thyme. I never use these. They're just here because they smell good. <laughs> And then my yar yarrow bloomed nicely this year, but the blooms are dying off, as you can see. Still a few on there, but not very many. And then you see, I don't know if you can see it, but there's some tarragon mixed in there with my gladiola. Oh, the gladiolas are blooming. Here's my sage. It's looking pitiful, but it'll be okay. It just looks that way because I cut it back quite a bit. And then my echinacea is over there. And this lavender plant held on. I'm probably going to pull it out because a lot of it is dying. I have the another one up on the deck to replace this one. So that is it for the garden, except for my rosemary. I didn't show you it. It's up on the, in a pot on the deck, but it's doing fine, unlike my vegetables out here but hopefully we'll see how they do with the sun coming out it was a nice sunny day today so hopefully I'll get something but thank you all so much for watching I hope your gardens are doing well and I will see you all in the next video thanks for watching